Hi, uh, there may be a uh, contrived push-pull out financed by people supporting uh, uh, Mid-Rise Hotel on Miracle Mile, uh, it's Jackson Rip Holmes. Uh, I urge you to uh, be aware of this and uh, speak out against it. Um, what a push-pull does is, you know, they basically try to get you to say that you support their position by misstating the questions. You, you get a loaded question, and then if you respond to it, and the only way that it's phrased, uh, you, it, they can make it look like you support, for instance, a high-rise miracle mile, which would bring urbanization and crime, change the very nature of Coral Gables as people move to true suburbs. If Miracle Mile, the main street of Coral Gables, goes to uh, the seven-story hotel, 50, ultimately 15-story buildings, because this breaks the, the, the height limit, then uh, the next thing that happens is uh, people, especially new people, think about this, they, they're not gonna move to an urbanized setting they don't, they don't want any crime that could hurt their children. Their children are untouchable. They'll move to Pinecrest, they'll move to uh, Palmetto Bay, Cutler Bay, uh, Kendale Lakes, and so on, Doral. And then we lose our greatest asset in Coral Gables. So I urge you to speak out against this hotel, seven-story hotel, It'll be the highest building on Miracle Mile by far, the only, uh, by far. And, uh, be it through the city commissioners, be it to uh, the Miami Herald, Gables Insider Magazine, any way you can on your own uh, social media.